To compute this, recall that b equals the sum of the product of the difference of the x's from the mean and the y's from the mean divided by the square difference between x and the mean. So the mean of the x's is 104 and the mean of the y's is 100. So now let's write our deviations for each term. And now for the differences of the y's. And if we add up the product of these, we get a fairly large number, 896,000. And the denominator is equal to 892,100. Taking the ratio of these two things gives us our answer of 1.004. This is interesting because it suggests when we have data like this, but add one single point all the way over here, our best fit line goes from being this to being this. Now note this isn't quite to scale. This point would really be all the way over here. 